This video is how to use the bedtime feature in clock on your iPhone. First you got to open it up. I've got mine set to world clock, the first one. So I gotta, you have to go down here. And these are all of the different settings that you can use. World clock, alarm, bedtime, stopwatch. But we're going to go to bedtime. Cha ching And this is what you get in bedtime. And this is to help you go to sleep at the right time and to get up at the right time. If you can, if you notice right now, um, it's off. So what you have to do is click this. It's going to bring you to this and the other page. And then if you want to turn it on, you just go here. Yeah, done. Right, so it's got, right now it's set for sleepy time at 12.05 and wake up at 6 a.m. And if you, look, if you notice in the center of it, it says 5 hours and 55 minutes. That's how many minutes you would be sleeping. So as I move it, like I moved it up to 9.30 or 9.25, that means I'm going to have 9 hours and 20 minutes. And what we're going to do is we're going to set it at 925, and we're going to watch the alarm go off. But you also have to turn on that day. You notice that today is Sunday, and I've got every day but Sunday turned on. So I've got to go in there, and I've got to press that S to the right, just above the word wake up, and make sure that I've got it turned on for this day. Otherwise, if I don't, it's not going to give me that alarm. So what we're going to do is we're going to set that. At 9.25, it's going to ring. Uh, if you look, it says 9.20 right now, but um, we've got all of the days set. If I click these days, that turns them off. So if they're gray, they're off. If they're yellow, they're on. So and look, I'm moving it around. There's 9.30, 9.25, 9.30. So wherever I put it is when it's going to ring, and you can change that. Um, and so we're going to check that out in a minute. We're going to let it ring. And, uh, and then we're going to go through the snooze alarm. I'm going to show you how that works. So I'm going to pull it back to a 925 since it's only 920 right now. And then we only have to wait another five minutes. As you can see, that's the alarm. And if you want to hit snooze, you just press this. Bam, done. All right, so once you press the uh, snooze alarm, part of the alarm, it's going to give you another nine minutes to chill out. If you read this, it says, calls will be silenced. Whoops, let me click that again. Calls will be silenced and notifications will appear in Notification Center until your wake-up alarm rings at 9.34 a.m. So the phone won't wake you up with all those distracting, you know, things that you have on it that draws your attention to it. So that's how it works on the snooze. So we just have to wait, and uh, right now it's... Uh, 9:25. It's uh, on August uh, 16th. It's Sunday. So we got 30, 29 seconds left. 22 seconds left. You can see it just immediately turns off because it's trying to keep you sleeping. Otherwise, it would, you know, it lights up the room. 11 seconds. There it goes. As you can see, that's the alarm. So there's our alarm. It's waking us up. If you want to stop it, you hit it here. Swipe up to open, or you can hit snooze so you can sleep more. That stops it. It says good morning, showers. <laughs> and uh, you can dismiss it if you want. And then bam, you're ready to go. That's it. But bam. And there we are. Swipe up. Face ID. And we're in. And that's it. And that's how you use your bedtime app on your iPhone. All right. If you have any questions or comments or you want me to make a video about something, please feel free to leave them in the comments. All right. Peace out. Oh, and subscribe and, you know, do all that stuff.